Ahoy, fellas! Oh, right, we're doing this. Oh, right. Right. Isn't this just a... Isn't this just a, like, look where it is, you know, kind of deal? Um... Oh, wait, right. <laughs> oh, well, at least I'm not in the way this time, right? Um... So, I got back from the theater, uh, from watching the Five Nights at Freddy's movie not too long ago, right? And by not too long ago, I mean, like, an hour and a half ago, maybe, tops. Uh, oh, this is interesting. <laughs> I I'm not gonna lie, maybe it's because I already did everything in the town, but none of these really scream out at me as being overly difficult. Okay, this one looks interesting. But, yeah, great film. I gotta say, I was very impressed. Um, I thought it was maybe a bit much that every time they answered a phone call, they answered it as a, Hello? Hello? You know, I, I thought that was a, an odd artistic choice. And, um, you know, but it, it was pretty funny when, when the guy telling him about the job said... Uh, Come on, can't you just try five nights at Freddy's? You know, because he didn't he didn't want the job at first. You know, it was a it was, it was a, a, a a great line, I must say. You know, it'll be an instant classic in my head. I don't see how you I I don't see how you really uh, get around that kind of notoriety. Like there's just there's no <laughs> and it, you know a bit of a. a Maybe a bit of a spoiler warning, I, I suppose I should have said beforehand. Um, you know, I will be spoiling the entire thing, of course. And, you know, it, it's just, just the way that it is. Uh, I thought it was perhaps perhaps an odd artistic choice to actually show, you know, real real live slow motion footage of a little boy having his, his head bitten down on by an animatronic. You know, kind of jarring, really. But, uh... I guess I can't really complain. I'm not. I'm not really a. I'm not an art major or anything. So, uh, whatever. Whatever floats your boat, guys. I just thought it was maybe a little bit much that you needed to see the whole thing, you know. And of course, oh well. This isn't this something. Is this basically a maze? I think this is basically a maze. Where even is the exit? There it is. Okay. Always solve mazes from the end. That's just how it works. So it'll be like this. This is going to be the whole bit for them for the whole uh, episode, by the way. That I saw FNAF, and I'm going to be quote unquote spoiling it. And uh... <laughs> it honestly, it honestly was a pretty entertaining movie. I especially like the, I especially like the uh, the Markiplier cameo, where he he comes in and he says, "87," uh, you know. Like uh, they, they, uh, you know, he's the, he's the, he's the ta He, they, they. I forget what they used him for. They had to get in like a, a cab or something, right? And uh, you know, so he, so the cab driver, you know, they, they end up taking a meandering course. Like they don't, they don't take the direct route, of course. And uh, you know, he, so the cab driver, he looks at the. He look. He looks at the. Uh, he, he looks at the the total for the, the 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 you know the running total for the uh, the entire trip, and it's the biggest total he's ever seen. You know, eighty seven dollars. He goes, is that eighty seven? Yeah, of course. And oh no, oh gee, wait, this door opens for something, doesn't it? Because I remember I saw another cable. Hey hey, I knew it. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Um, where did that cable branch off from again? Oh, God, can I even get back where I was going? <laughs> Here we are. Oh, boy. Yeah, that was almost bad, sort of. Maybe. Oh, great, it's semi-obscured. Oh, my gosh. That is super clever. That is so clever. Okay. I don't dislike that. I do not dislike that. I like that it's symmetric, too, but that's probably not going to stay that way for long, huh? Um, oh. Okay. 
I guess I have to see from in here. All right, very nice. I'm gonna try and remember. Oh no, I'm not. I'm just barely not passing there. Um. Ah, okay. I get it. I do get it. I swear I get it. Yeah. Very odd choice to not include um, Foxy at all. Like Foxy wasn't in the movie. Like I thought that was thought that was a little weird since Foxy's like you know a big part of the the franchise. But you know, I, I guess to each their own. Scott can kind of do whatever the hell he wants, you know. And it, I found it particularly odd that uh, actually none of them were in in the film at all and I was actually watching a completely different film with Nicolas Cage in it anyways <laughs> I don't think I can get away with this oh my gosh this is evil there are two starts I was I didn't even I didn't even see this other one at first so oh boy I think that's two over one up I mean honestly this is probably one of the easier puzzles I like this a little bit more since it's honestly pretty easy, you can see the whole thing. But, wow. Oh my gosh, this is actually evil though. Sort of. I wonder if I can... Oh my gosh. I mean, don't get me wrong, this is probably the hardest and weirdest way of doing it. And I can't do the whole thing. Damn. You know, this was almost a really good idea, I swear. Okay, but I remember it now, so let's just, uh, before I forget, over, down, yeah, <laughs> uh, good times. Huh? Oh, that's gonna be a fun one. Okay, okay, at least it's on the rock, right? You can kind of see it. Wouldn't it be funny? Oh... That's a little disappointing that there isn't a hidden environmental puzzle for the environmental part of an actual puzzle. <laughs> okay, okay, over, up, over. This is honestly another kind of simple one, it seems like. Not that I have a problem with that, I really don't. You don't have to not... Okay, hold on. Yeah, I missed a bend. Almost, almost. Yeah. I found it I found it particularly odd and maybe a bit of a forced line that uh, the uh, when when Freddy without like without even any kind of animatronic voice said it's fretting time it's Fred bearing time and Fred bared all over the place I thought ah, that was a, a little odd maybe, it maybe didn't really need to be that kind of interaction. Um, but, uh, again, I mean, I'm not the director, and Scott can do whatever the hell he wants with his own movie, I guess. It was, it was, uh, it was just kind of weird to me to decide to do that. Oh, this is interesting. So, yeah, if you don't already get it, very good movie. The bird was hot, um, and, oh... Oh. Oh. I think I get it. I think? Oh, no, no. It's meant to be like this? Oh, that is evil. Oh, my gosh. I think I think I get it. I'm just going to do it from over here, though, just in case. Just in case I don't actually get it. Okay, I do get it. I absolutely do. Up in the middle... It's like, it's kind of funny when they do an environment, oh, darn. I was about to say, you know, it's kind of funny when they do a puzzle like this and it's still actually really easy. So, my bad, I was wrong. How would it not be this? Um, huh. That checks out, that checks all the boxes. Hmm. Because I think this is what we're going for, right? No. Uh. God, that is wacky. Also, again... Oh, darn. That would have been really 
really interesting. Huh. Oh, okay, I see it. It's because it's because I went too far on this line. All right. So it's actually like this. Yes. Yippee. I love doing easier areas after difficult areas. God, I still don't know. How did I not... How did I open this door? Right. This is the castle, right? Okay, good. I actually needed to do something here anyways. Bit of a detour. I know. Sorry. Well, I'm not going to apologize because I never apologize to anybody. If I were apologizing any time I'd wronged someone, I would be apologizing all the time. Like, constantly while making these videos. Because if anybody is watching these, I am so sorry for your loss. <laughs> um, where was it? Where was it? There's got... There has to be. There has to be. Yes! See this? There's gotta be something, right? It's gotta be. Um, does it go... Th oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, it goes... It's, it goes everywhere, huh? There's gotta be... Okay, I see it now. I see it now. I see it now. Look at that! Biggest freaking environmental puzzle in the world. And there's another one. Yippee! Uh, where else? Where else? Where else? There has to be more, right? I say. I kind of hope there ain't, in all honesty, because then I don't have to do any more. Like, I mean, I know I kind of said, like, oh, we're going to have an environmental puzzle version. Also, don't tell me... Oh my gosh, that is evil. That is pure evil. That is actually pure evil. That is evil, man. How would I even get some of these? I don't think there's actually a way to do a couple of those. Like, I would have to be really lined up. I'd have to be, like, over here or something to get the yellow one. So I guess those are, like, available, but you can't get all of them? Maybe? If I could see it from above. If I could see it from directly above, that would be great. Okay. Well, anyways... Yeah. I found it particularly interesting that um, every time the animatronics moved, it played the... Uh, yeah. Exactly like that, too. Like, like as if it were spinning on a record. Um, it was an, an interesting choice, and then it would, like, cut out if they ever stopped moving, which was all the time, because they really do move like real animatronic characters, you know. So, it would be more like... Yeah, and I I I found it to be a, a pretty nice cameo that there there was a singing fish in a fishbowl saying uh, don't pee on the floor use the commodore, um, but uh, again maybe a bit forced, uh, kind uh, kind of kind of an odd inclusion in my book, but I you know I'm not really complaining. Now this is odd. Oh, oh my gosh. It's half and half. I have to avoid the shadows on one side and follow the shadows on the other side. That is, that is interesting. I do like this game. Can't wait for The Witness 2. Wow, that's this entire area, huh? I guess that does check out because this was like, this was a very barren side of the, of the uh, whole area, you know? Please tell me, like, this makes a big nether portal sound or something, so that I know I have everything. I mean, this is seven beams. Or it'll be seven beams, if it actually shoots off. It looks like it's about to. It's gonna try. I guess I can go up there and see if it, if something's, like, open, alright? Is it gonna, is it gonna do the thing? Yeah, there we go, baby. Oh, yeah. There's got to be some more stuff around here, right? Come on! Show me a, show me an audio clip or something. It's going to say... Uh, it's going to say... Ooh! Ooh -hoo. Sixty-six times have these eyes beheld the changing scene of autumn. I have said enough about moonlight. Ask no more. Only listen to the voice of pines and cedars when no wind stirs. Theonin, 1711. 
Ooh. That was an interesting one. Um, I guess that's, uh, well, anyways. Yeah, it, it's a nice quote. Uh, I suppose just a kind of a natural dealio, you know? I have no idea who Ryonin is. I don't know too many people without last names, you know, Zendaya, um, Yay. That, that's about it, really. Oh my gosh, I saw, um, <laughs> I saw, it was an article headline about, um, North Korean dictator Kim Jong-un firing off a missile, but it was, um, the way it was phrased, it was, uh, oh my gosh, I might have to find this and put it up on the screen. It was like, Kim fires missile at South Korea to taunt West. It's like, or, or Kim taunts West by firing off missile at South Korea. And and somebody put the caption like, dang, that girl needs to leave Kanye alone. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyways, I don't think, uh, uh, -uh. Yeah, I'll, I'll leave it at that. Please tell me the sun is part of a puzzle at some point. Everything is a puzzle here. Come on. The whole place is a puzzle. What a mystery, gang. This is a big mystery gang. I... I that's not a reference to anything. Haha, ha, let's, let's leave it at that. Till next time, like, comment, and subscribe, or I will... Um... I will... I'll drown you, I guess. I will, I'll, ah, I'll stuff you into a spring-locked uh, animatronic suit and then splash water upon you so that the spring locks fail and uh, the mechanism crushes your body and leaves you shaking and lifeless. Ha 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 ha. Yeah. Uh, I gotta say, though, it was interesting that they decided to have that scene going for 20 entire minutes. I think it might have even been 30. I lost count after a little while. Um, but, you know, I mean, Scott can make his movie however he wants. Just thought it was an odd artistic choice. And goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.